Some of you all want to see what my truck looks like, so I so I finally give, do a video, I got to put back together where it's presentable, I guess you could say. It's a 1992 Chevrolet K1500 four-wheel drive sport edition. That is a factory package, very kind of a rare package, although I got lucky and found this one. It's a uh, just a single cab, floor bed, and that's part of the package. Okay, I don't think they offered anything else. This one has a six inch super lift on it. I have 35, 1250 Toyo, Toyo Open Country MTs on it. Uh, and 17 by nine black Raceline Assault wheels. I'll get up front here so you guys can actually see what the wheels look like when they're halfway clean because this truck is permanently muddy. See there, pretty cool. I actually got a pretty good deal on them. They're my grad gift, so I got lucky. I put the newer 1994 grill on it. Just got the new emblem on it today. And then the bumper is a work truck style smoothie. The original bumper had the impact strips, which I thought were uglier than sin. Let me climb inside and start it up, and I'll show you around what's done inside. Hopefully I didn't leave the sound system on full blast, or I'm gonna miss my hearing. Oh, Lord, this thing is tall. Ski. See in here, we got the radio in here. I did the, put the bucket seats in. Thank you, Randy Newton. This came with a bench, but I freaking hate the bench. Right behind the seat here, you can see, hopefully. Nope. I have amp subs back here. Don't mind my toe strap. Let me fire it up here and I'll show you what's under the hood. Just a pretty mild old truck. See, it's makes some good noise. It's got a super 10 full master that's kind of redneck dumped. Well, the pipe's rusted off, but if I can get away, you can hear it better. Freaking loud. My friends know before I even pull on the road. <sighs> Under the hood, it's pretty stock. Just did MSD wires. I got sick of replacing crap ass factory ones. Under the lid, there's a K&N filter and then the Hypertech bowl underneath. I don't think I can get hidden to see it. move around. Got the Hypertech bowl down here. This you can kind of see on the intake there, but it seems to help a little bit. Moves along pretty good for an old truck. I've had it at 105 on the GPS. Don't mind the Ford, that's my dad's. Well, I'm trying to think of anything else I'm missing, but I've done a lot to this truck, put a lot into it. Done the. Had to have the transmission rebuilt, had to have transfer case put in. It was pretty heavy duty, this old truck. It's got, let's see if you can see it, 264,811 on the body, about 75,000 on the motor, and 10,000 on the trans, nine, 10,000 on the trans, 5,000 on a transfer case. Word knows that this truck has been a pain in my butt, but I love it.